Airline experts say the toll coronavirus is taking on the travel industry is worse than any crisis we have ever seen. And a big reason for that, we don't know when recovery will begin. Right now, most Americans are avoiding travel due to the pandemic. Tennessee's biggest airport, the Nashville International Airport, is only seeing around 2,000 passengers a day. That's a drop from the normal 50,000 a day. And even after things reopen, a transportation analyst says it may be a while before people feel comfortable flying again. But the problem this time is that when we try to look for precedent, uh, uh, something in the past that tells us what's going to happen here, there is no precedent. This is, this is just so different. And the range of possibilities has kept shifting. Uh, you know, the things that seemed like the worst case scenario a month or two ago are now better than the best case scenario going forward. At some point here, uh, there, there will be some kind of good news, right? I mean, it's not just going to keep getting worse forever, uh, but to try to call a bottom, so to speak, and say, all right, here we are. You know, tomorrow's going to be better than today. We, we've, we've thought that a lot of times already, that we had seen the worst of it, and then it has kept getting worse. So. Now, we are told China has seen an increase in travel since its COVID-19 peak. This should be encouraging to Americans that travel may bounce back maybe quicker than expected.